Hello and welcome back to another vlog. Here we are, just staring at the spot where mere hours ago my PC used to be standing and now, there's nothing. Nothing except for a whole bunch of dirt. Apparently I don't clean here enough. But it is terrible. It's absolutely terrible. I can't actually believe it. Like, a couple of days after our internet gets fixed, my PC decides, well, you know, Lumen, I've had enough. All this rendering, this frapsing of gameplay footage, all this stuff you constantly storing on me. No! I'm done with it. I'm checking out right now. And so he or she did. It's done. But I'm actually being a little bit melodramatic here. It's not actually done. My PC was fine this morning, but it was actually getting incredibly hot. Like, really, really, really hot. I'm talking 95 degrees Celsius. I don't know what that is in Fahrenheit, but it's pretty high. 100 degrees is boiling point, isn't it? So, just think about that for a second. Are you done? Good. Good. I'm glad you thought about it. Now you know the extent of my pain, and my CPU's pain as well. I've actually got one of the first generation i7 CPUs. My PC is old, okay? And since I got it, I hadn't actually done any maintenance on it. I hadn't cleaned inside. The thermal paste that's between the chip and the motherboard is still the original thermal paste that was there when I got the PC. So, who knows? It could be something really simple like the thermal paste is just worn through. I don't know if that really happens. That would be my guess. It could be that the chip is on its last legs. That's also possible. And I suppose a chip of equivalent speed nowadays isn't that expensive. But I'm just not ready to upgrade my PC yet. I'm not ready to get a new PC yet. I just don't think I'd be able to do that right now. So I'm hoping that the place that I took it to, which I must add, I don't have much faith in. I don't have faith in any of the PC shops in this town because it's a really small town and the kind of problems that people have here are the kind where they forget to plug their screen cable in. Sometimes they plug their mouse into the wrong port, into a port where it shouldn't actually be able to go into and then they wonder why the mouse isn't working when they're in Windows. Sometimes they're not sure why the simplest things aren't working, but it ends up being the simplest solution. So that's the kind of problems they deal with here. And something that I've, the, the problem that I've got right now may be out of their league. Who knows? Okay. Who the heck knows? I might know within an hour or two. I'm just showing you Nero sleeping here because it's incredibly hot today. And he's been doing this roadkill pose all over the house. Right now he's doing it here because daddy is here. And he says, Daddy, I'll come and sulk with you. We can sulk together. <laughs> At least till you take me for a walk later. Right, Daddy? Yes. Yes, Nero. That sounds good. Okay. Oh, it's very nice. That is very, very nice. <laughs> what a handsome guy. What a handsome puppy. You just have your snooze, okay? But, I'm without a PC right now, and it's quite difficult. I am so used to just sitting here doing things pretty much all day long on my PC. We just got back from the gym now. Just before the gym, I dropped my PC off at the shop and in about a half an hour or so, I'm gonna go and check up and see what they're doing because I told them, I went in there and I told them, there's no way I'm leaving my PC here overnight. I want you to look at it right now. I'm coming back in two hours time and then I want you to give me your assessment. And that was that, then I left. I know it sounds a little bit mean or a little bit harsh, but I honestly think that if I'm paying them, I can demand the service that I want from them. So that's that. That's what I told them, and I'm hoping that it's not anything too serious. Maybe they need to replace my CPU fan. It seemed fine. It was running at the right RPM or whatever it runs at. Uh, it was actually doing a reasonably good job till now, so I'm just not sure if it would be that. I don't know what it is, but they're looking at it. I don't want to upgrade my PC, so I'm hoping it's not anything too serious. Look at that. <sighs> that void needs to be filled, and soon. It really does. You know what's really bad is that I've got two videos that I wanted to render. Last night, before I went to sleep, I turned on, or I, I started rendering one video, which was XCOM. And then this morning I came back, my PC was at the login screen. Windows login screen. And then I thought, well, okay, maybe it's Windows Update. Maybe it was Windows Update. But then I got into Windows, I checked the update settings, and 
it was most definitely not that. So then I thought, well, that's a little bit strange. Then I turned another rendering on and I went back to sleep. Because this was at like 5 o'clock this morning when Nero woke me up. I generally tend to, if I wake up at an unearthly hour, then I come check my PC, I put some more rendering on because I've always got a whole bunch of stuff that needs to be rendered, and then I go back to bed if, you know, I've done what I needed to do. Sometimes I feed Nero if it's a tiny bit later, like 6 o'clock. 6 o'clock is Nero's food time. Oh, yes. You like your food at 6 o'clock, hey? That's the perfect time. Sometimes he sleeps till 8 o'clock. It's all up to him, you see. It's all up to Nero. He wakes me up when he's ready for food. No. Close those eyes. You're not having any right now. <laughs> so, I did that. My PC was, had been restarted. And then I, came, then I went back to sleep. I came back. Bam! Restarted again. So then I knew something was up. And then I sat here watching when I started the next rendering and I saw that the temperature was just going up and up and up and I'm assuming that at some point it got to the critical mass where it would restart and then it restarted. Done and done. So, I'm waiting on whatever they have to say. Hoping it's not too bad because I do not want to be replacing any expensive parts right now. I don't. I really don't. And I need to get videos up. Because as you well know, I like uploading videos every day. Multiple videos every day, especially because our internet can now actually handle the amount of uploads I want to do. I want to do it. Wow, these are all glorious, aren't they? I really like them. I'm going to put the Skyrim map up soon, it's going to go over there. And then the Britannia map might go either above it or below it, or over here somewhere. Or maybe over there, I don't even know. This space right here. The Britannia map could fit in quite nicely. I'll just have to see. I will have to see where the maps take me. But, that is sadly going to be it for this video. I just wanted to tell you guys that things might be a little bit slower on the channel for the next day or two. Hopefully not too long. Hopefully I'm getting my PC back today and everything's going to be okay. I'm hoping for that. But if that doesn't happen, if it doesn't happen, well then it might be a few more days. I could still possibly record or re-record the Q&A because I've got the Q&A already on my PC right now and if I do get it back and it's okay and everything then I'm going to upload that but if I don't then I might just re-record it with my camera and then just put it straight onto that old PC in the corner there, upload it from there and everyone will be happy. So I can get a QA and a up, I can get vlogs up, I can't get the videos that I still need to render up because they didn't finish rendering. I never got Dishonored finished and I didn't get XCOM finished and the latest Dishonored video is so good. You need to see it. I want to upload it so you can see it. Man, this week is actually going to be really busy because this weekend that's coming now, we actually going back to my parents' farm again. We were just there this past weekend, but this time we're going for my sister's baby shower and one of my father's aunt's birthday parties. My father's aunt's birthday party. That's pretty much it. Okay, and it's a big deal because she's obviously a you know, prominent member of our family and it's a pretty high number that she's hitting. So everyone wants to be there and everyone wants to celebrate. So both those things are happening on the farm this weekend. We're only going for one night as we usually do because staying away for longer than one night just... It ends up being so, so bad for me because it ends up generating so much extra work. And because there's no internet on the farm, no proper usable internet, it makes it even more difficult. It's terrible. Hey, boy? He would never say it's terrible because he has the best time ever on the farm. Running and running and playing and running and walking and some more running, and then some more playing, and then a bit of a dip in the river. All those things make Nero a happy puppy. Wow. So, that's me for this video. Check back soon for more. I'm sorry if it wasn't anything super interesting, but I needed to tell you guys that I'm having problems and things might be a little bit slow around the channel. There you go. That's that. I hope to have everything sorted out soon. I'm probably going to record another vlog, like tomorrow or something. If I don't have it, my PC back yet, you're going to be seeing a lot of vlogs over the next couple of days. Maybe I'll talk about The Dark Knight Rises, because I said on Twitter, and if you're not following me on Twitter, the link is below, you should probably do it. I'm going to be whining there all day long. You can see my whining there. You can see how unhappy I am with the fact that I don't have my PC. 
and you can revel in it. <laughs> if you're that mean, then you can revel in it, you can point fingers and laugh. That would be cruel, but I wouldn't blame you. I would not blame you at all. But, Dark Knight Rises, I wanted to talk about that briefly, maybe. I watched it on my phone, actually, of all places, and I really enjoyed it, and I have quite a bit to say about it. Quite a bit, it was super long. So obviously I'm gonna have at least something to say about it. Then, the channel update just didn't happen yet, because I'm still struggling with my webcam, but hey, these things happen, I'm working on it. So, check back soon for more. Most importantly though, Happy Nero Puppy passed out on the carpet. Wow. You look really good on that colour, my boy. I mean, you look much better on green, but you look quite good on that colour. Hey? Hey, my schnapp? What's going on? Oh. All those kisses, boy. Man, he's being super calm right now. <laughs> the walk we went for this morning must have really taken it all out of him. Because it was super hot out there as well. Jeez Louise. Here we go, boy. Here we go. Take it slow. That's it. He is out. We are actually going to be making this a little bit bigger till about there soon so that he can go through there without touching his back on this. But if we make it till up here, if we just knock out another one of these windows till there, then it's a little bit too much because I would probably be able to squeeze myself through there then and I don't think we'd feel safe having a hole of that size in our door. So we're going to make it a little bit bigger for the little Nero puppy. And that's going to be that. I said I was going to finish this video. I'm done. I'm actually done. I'll finish it with an amazing pose next to Sokolov's elixir. <laughs> there we go. Happy that.